Hey YouTube. Uh, here's a. Uh, I, I, I wanted. To, I like the idea of playing around with these transformers power supplies, but of course they're dangerous. They're directly connected to the mains, and you know you can you can hurt yourself or even kill yourself playing with the mains. So I had this. Uh, I thought to myself, okay, so if I plug in. 240 volts and I've got 14 volts coming out of this end of this little transformer here little 240 volt 12 volt 20 VA transformer and then from the secondary of that connect that up to the secondary of this transformer which is just a little well I, I think for some reason I think it's 5 watts but anyway so I connect that the output of this secondary into the secondary of this one and then the output of this is close to 200 volts I'll show you that so I'll just pop that into there put this into here so it's still feeding this circuit but we're going to get a tap in on the AC on here so I give it some power and I'm just using my connector block here just snap that down for power now with this um, with this circuit on here if I if I were to unplug this okay so the actual oh, that's quite good it's showing that the circuit is taking up um, a bit of power there so without that circuit in line anyway um, we had more like 200 volts now if I just disconnect that because even though this is like this and it makes it a lot safer I'm still not as confident as what I'd like to be while playing around with the main so if I just disconnect that there we should have the circuit now there we go 200 volts because that you know that there is not uh, that's not taking anything but it's nice to see how quickly it drops and even when there's just a little tiny load on it So, um, and so really that does give a lot safer environment I suppose for playing around with these circuits um, we've got still 168-69 volts there um, yeah it was just a little transformer experiment just to see you know if that would have any problems just a little, little temperature check nothing temperature check ah that's a little warm it's not hot or anything like that and it's just uh, you know, uh, it's just not as cold as that you know if i touch this glass that's cold well, it's not cold but oh shut up I'm talking to myself not you uh right so there you go i just wanted to see what would happen if you did that um and it makes the you know directly tapping to the mains 200 200 volts uh, a lot safer Yeah, that's so what I've done. Is I've just hooked this uh, this little LED lamp to the circuit. You can see the camera moving. So anyway, I put that down. Now, what it won't do is it won't let us go onto white. If I try and put it onto white, it switches off. Um, when it goes through these colours, that's what it first starts off with. But I can switch it onto a colour and leave it on. But if I try to put it onto the, any of the settings like fade, as soon as it has to go and do it, boom, it just switches itself off because there's obviously not enough power and puts it back into a reset mode. But you can put a, a single colour on. You've got enough power to do that. But not enough power to put white on and just switches it straight off if I try and put white on it switches it straight off and if I try and do any of the uh, you know apart from the ones I just change the colour anyway um, I'm just trying to get that to stay on green yeah stay on red stay on different it looks actually green but it's a blue 
Blue, blue. There we go. Let's switch it off. That's all done with the little remote. Cheers, watching.